Hi everybody, welcome to my channel, Rosie Cooks. I'm gonna make some green chili using hatch green chilies. I have two big hatch green chilies. They're in season right now. I'm gonna use two garlic cloves, two Roma tomatoes, and half of an onion. This is one and a half pounds of flap meat. You can use thin sliced steak. I'm gonna cube this. This is a potato, a little bit of cilantro, salt, pepper, cumin, and nor chicken bouillon. Let's put it together. So first I'm going to roast my hatch green chilies until they have a nice char on the outside. This adds a lot of flavor. So here's my hatch green chili. They're nice and charred. I remove the stem and I'm chopping them up into small pieces like this. Okay, just small pieces. And here we are, all diced up. So here's my onion and the same thing. I'm going to chop them into small diced pieces. Here's my onion. Here's my tomato. I'm dicing it into small pieces. Here's my potato diced into nice little pieces. Here's my cilantro. Here's my garlic. So here's my steak pieces. Everything's been cut into small bite-sized pieces. So now let's start cooking. So right here I have a large skillet. I'm adding some olive oil, about a tablespoon. I'm gonna add my beef. And I'm gonna cook that up. So here's my beef, and it's not completely cooked, but it's really getting there. So I'm gonna get rid of some of this juice. I'm just gonna I'm gonna get rid of most of it. Not all of it, but most of it. So right here you can see, it doesn't have as much juice as it had before. So now I'm gonna start adding my chilies so they can all start getting nice and soft. I'm going to cook up my onions and my tomatoes. Let everything cook together. Now I'm going to add my cilantro and my garlic. Right here I have one teaspoon of cumin, one teaspoon of black pepper, half a teaspoon of nor chicken bouillon, and half a teaspoon of salt. Now, I might salt it a little bit later if it needs it. So now I'm gonna cover this and let it cook for a few minutes. Let everything incorporate. So this has been cooking for five minutes. So now I'm gonna add my potatoes. I'm gonna mix these up. I'm gonna add half a cup of water, cover it, and let it cook until those potatoes are completely fork tender. This is looking really, really good. I'm gonna have to cut that one. Here's my half cup of water. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna add another half cup. So that's a whole cup of, of water. And I did add a little bit more salt. Now you're gonna cook this until all your potatoes are work tender and your meat is tender. 
So I'm gonna cover this and I'm gonna let it keep cooking. So this is my hatch green chili with potatoes. It came up very, very tasty. It has a really, really good flavor. It has a little bit of broth right here. Look at that, nice. This came out really, really good. I did add that little half teaspoon of salt extra. I thought it needed it. You salt it to your taste buds. This is a really good dinner. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, give me a thumbs up if you like the recipe, and I'll see you next time.